Pagers exploding across Lebanon with hundreds of Hezbollah members seriously injured and ambulances rushing to the scene. Arab and Israeli media report communication devices detonated when those receiving calls picked them up. Lebanese security alleges the explosions were caused by Israel hacking into Hezbollah's radio communication system. Well, joining us with more and other issues facing Israel is Ohad Tal. He is a member of the Israeli Knesset with the National Religious Party, uh, Religious Zionism. This is a big breach of security, is it not, for Hezbollah? How did this possibly happen? First of all, I think uh, I would recommend every person who holds a beeper or uh, uh, these kind of devices to have a, a proper antivirus on his, uh, on his uh, phone. Uh, but being serious, um, I think what we've seen today, uh, of course I cannot confirm who did it. I don't know. I don't know if Israel done that or uh, maybe Israel has a capability though. Or maybe right? it was just you know, a malfunctioning in, uh, in, their, in their devices. Yeah. But uh, one, one thing is for sure, yeah. Hezbollah is a threat not just for Israel, it's a threat to the peace of the world because what they're trying to do is to destabilize the region completely. They want to destroy Israel, they want to destabilize the region, they're working for Iran in order to destabilize the world and they have to pay the price. Hezbollah has to pay the price, Hezbollah has to be uh, uh, eradicated because you know, I just, I don't know if you're, if you, if you're aware, but as we speak there's a, about 100,000 Israelis out of their homes for 11 months. People are refugees in their own country for 11 months. Families, whole communities. We have to bring them back home. But we have to bring them back home safely. And that can only be achieved if Hamas is eradicated, not even close to our borders. Only then we can bring back our people back home. 